Yo, what's up, peoples? This is AG, man, coming at y'all with another quick tutorial for Machine Masters. Um, and this one right here, I wanted to go ahead and show y'all a quick way to drag and drop your samples um, when you're chopping. So I got a sample loaded up, and what I did was put it all on, you know, put it on pad 16. And now, just let's go ahead. We in sample. Let's go ahead and uh, pull up the slice. All right, and it's split. This is a whole song, so it's split in 16 pieces. And a lot of times, you might have like two or three sections within a song that you want to use. And this, to me, would be an easy way to go ahead and um, find those songs and or uh, find those sections and chop them up real quick, where you can use them on different groups. All right, so let's use this one. Let's see what this one is. All right, so let's go ahead. And how you stop that uh, the sample from playing now? If you're on your machine, just hit Shift and Mute, and that'll automatically stop anything that's playing. So that's pretty cool too. You don't have to wait or come up with a workaround to stop the samples from playing. All right, so let's go ahead and drag drag this one to pad one. All right, so that's on pad one now. Now let's say we got uh, another part in the song that we like. Let me go ahead and zoom out just a little bit. So let's start here. We've been friends much too long. I'm tired of hearing that same old song My feelings are deep, they are strong Let's make love Alright, so I don't want nothing in there. Let's try this part right here. Let's make love oh, It's hot time that I told you Alright, let's say I wanted that little change. Let's make love I told you that we can't can't go on like, on like this. It's hot time that I told you that we can't can't go on, on like, this. like this. It's hot time that I told you that we can't can't go on. Like Alright, now let's say we wanted to take this part right here. We can take this and drag it it's hot time that I told you. to pad 2. Alright, and the reason that we're doing this is because now if we go ahead and click on, on this pad and we go into edit, now we just have that section right there that we wanted. So now we can truncate that. So, let me go to pull that over just a little bit more. Truncate it again. All right, now we got this right here, which is the, the section that we wanted, the first section. So check it out. If we play it. All right, now, which is, you know, the dope part, because you can take this, this sample right here, and um, let's go into to slice. So now it's sliced up, and it's just the, the piece that we wanted from the song, that little section that we wanted. So just say, for instance, if these are sliced the right way, you can um, fine tune them. Fine tune them if you wanted to, go in and tighten them up. You know. But I'm not going to do all of that. Now, what you can do is you can take that, click this button right here, and that's going to be the apply to button, the same as on the machines. 
and we're going to take that and drag it to group C. So now we got everything mapped out on group C, um, you know, chopped up. And you can chop it however you want to, but if we played that. You know, you can kind of pretty much play it any kind of way you want. And um, what I suggest is you go ahead and, and uh, right click on the, on the group or on the pattern and um, click reset. That way it'll take away all the, um, the, the sequence that uh, machine automatically mapped out for you. So now let's go back to group B again. And now we're going to go to our second section of the song that we wanted. All right, we're going to come out of slice, go to edit. And that's going to put us you know, the starts and end points is right there. So now we want to go ahead and truncate that. So it's just a portion of the song that we wanted. All right, let's pull this over just a little bit. Truncate it again. All right, now same thing. We can go in can slice it to 16 you know if we wanted to or we can you know pretty much slice it however we wanted to take this click this button pull it to group D let's go ahead and reset the pattern and now on group D you got you go back to group C, you got group D. Alright, and that's pretty much a way that you can, you know, go through and you can have all your chops lined out. You can, you know, have all your sections done because a lot of times you might, what I, I run into is like sometimes I might um, chop out a section of a song that I like and then I'll go back to the song again and try to find, you know, something else. But this way you can go through the entire song at that same time, you know, just grabbing the pieces that you want, chopping them up. And then when you're ready to lay it down, you got, you know, your your verse part, you got your hook part, you got your bridge, however you want to do it, man. So I think this is real beneficial, man. I shout out uh, the guys that kind of pointed this out to me, you know. I took from what they said and put it to my use. So that was just something real quick that I wanted to bring to y'all, man. Uh, make sure y'all go and check out MachineMasters.com. Uh, we're going to be having that site up pretty soon, but you can join the mailing list right now. And we're doing something called uh, Sample Pack Saturdays where we send out samples um, early Saturday morning for the weekend, man. So, um, yeah, go ahead and sign up, man. And until the next vid, I'll holler at y'all. Peace.